Yeah, impacts a lot, especially a guy that's 35 years old, still, still dunking the way he's dunking. You know, he's freak of nature, man. And, like, to have this kind of energy every single night, you know, and bring it every single night, um, it's crazy. But that's who he is, and that's why he's a Hall of Famer, and that's why he's been an MVP. And just what he brings every single night, we need that rust tonight. We need it every night. The LA Clippers are coming off such a big win last night when they defeated the defending champion Denver Nuggets and Nikola Jokic. Now we are about a couple of weeks away from the start of the NBA playoffs and you know we really need to see teams lock in, especially the LA Clippers. Now in my opinion they are one of the most underrated, one of the deepest, but also one of the toughest teams to beat in the NBA when they're all playing at a high physical level. Now, the definition of toughness is this man right here, Russell Westbrook. And since he's been back, they're starting to play a little better basketball, and I expect them to fully gear up for a huge playoff run in the next few weeks. But it all is going to depend on how they play as a team. Now, real quickly, we're going to break down everything you need to know about the LA Clippers, how they won this game, but more importantly, how they might be able to go on a massive playoff run to win it all this season okay now the first play i want to break down is a a really important one right now whenever russell westbrook is in the game he can change the entire dynamic of an offense just because he can make any pass but also changes the way the defense perceives the offense which is actually pretty massive in today's nba so right away what are we going to see we're going to get a double screen here one by paul george and then another one by zubak now the thing to notice on this play though is we're going to get a go screen here by zubak and a real screen by paul george what they are trying to do here is trying to get norm powell to curl off the screen into the paint for a wide open layup now the one thing we notice here is you have some weak side help here by reggie jackson obviously the weak side is the opposite side of the ball and this would be the strong side so on the strong side you have a bunch of guys over here and one weak side corner player over here in amir coffee now what to realize is you know Jokic, all of his attention is on Zubak. We have Norm Powell trying to curl over the screen, but Russell Westbrook notices there is no backside help here. If he can spin off Christian Brown, he's going to get an easy layup at the bucket. Boom, drives in. Pretty much no contest there and no stopping Russell Westbrook. Guys, Russell Westbrook changes the entire dynamic here in LA. Let's continue to break it down. All right, another reason I love this Clippers team is because their versatility offensively and they can really spread the floor. Now in this play here, we're going to see James Harden and Mason Plumlee run a spread pick and roll. Now what that basically means is, you know, it says it in the title. A spread pick and roll is when everyone's split out to the three point line and nobody is congesting the paint. Now a lot of teams run this, especially over there in Brooklyn with Jack down what this play consists of is a screen you know usually when you have a guy like you know james harden for example he's going to get double teamed off the switch or off the screen so boom right away he's going to get the ball to mason plumley now this is not a play where mason plumley is it's designed from the score it's not right this play is strictly for him to pass the ball off the pass right so harden kicks it over to Mason Plumley. Now, Mason Plumley, he needs to read the floor, right? You have a double team up top. Now you can find where the bad rotation was. So boom, you get this guy playing the middle. So boom, right? Mason Plumley kicks over to uh, Russ, Russ, ball movement over to Coffee, Coffee, wide open three. Guys, this is a beautiful play run here by LA. You get that spread pick and roll. Let's get it to Mason Plumley. decipher the defense, read it, decide where to go with the basketball here. Boom, one dribble, pass, kick to the corner, extra swing, and gets it to go from three. Guys, beautiful basketball here by LA. Now, in my opinion, the key to the Clippers' success is Russell Westbrook. Obviously, the guys around them need to play good, right? But Russell Westbrook has the ability to take over games with his passing IQ. Right here, draws that defender, kicks over Norm Powell. But then from there, they have a bunch of guys that can make plays. We saw Amir Coffee. I also did want to apologize. I said Jared Allen in, in uh, Brooklyn. He's all now in Cleveland. So keep that in mind. I apologize for that. But Norm Powell can shoot. James Harden, Kawhi, um, you know, Paul George. All these guys can shoot the ball. They do it at a high level, but they also move the ball basketball really well. And when you have two really high level playmakers in James and, and Russell Westbrook here, man, the sky is the limit 
for your basketball team. And we saw that in the second quarter of this game when they went on a 33 to 18 run. Now do me a real quick favor guys, before we get any further into the video, do me a big favor. Hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, join the family. Guys, we are going to be covering the Clippers for the rest of the season, the postseason, the offseason, everything you guys need to know. We're going to post some more Clippers videos from here on out. So make sure you guys join the family. It's free, doesn't cost anything, but let's get right back into the film. All right, and this is one of the most unique plays I've seen in a while here. And again, perfectly run by Russell Westbrook, James Harden. You do this at a high level. So you're going to get your two wings in the corner, your two guys that are going to spread the floor and leave the paint relatively open. Now, what we're going to see here is a high pick and roll between Russell Westbrook and Mason Plumlee. Now, you guys are probably saying, well, what is James Harden doing? Okay, so this is where things become really important here. Harden is going to come up and set a backside screen on the switch man. So, boom, here we go. Let's set a screen on Reddy Jackson. We know in the NBA, they switch everything. The pick and roll is going to cause Russell Westbrook switch on to DeAndre Jordan, which is, which is a mismatch in itself. Now, James Harden is going to set a ghost screen. Okay. A ghost screen is basically when he's not actually going to set a screen, but Aaron Gordon is thinking he's setting the screen the whole time. It confuses the defense a little bit, and boom, Russell Westbrook is able to find Mason Plumlee wide open underneath the basket for an easy law play. Guys, this is next level type of basketball here, and you can see DeAndre Jordan is pissed because, you know, they don't even know what to do. They're trying to hedge Russell Westbrook off the second screen, but Aaron Gordon is trying to step up on James Harden. In reality, they just get confused. And, you know, you see DeAndre Jordan, you're like, bro, what is that defense? Where's the, the weak side help, the strong side help? Where is the help defense? It's not there because the Clippers are extremely smart in what they're trying to run here, and they keep it well disguised for most of the game. Guys, before we get any further into the video, go check out Underdog Fantasy. Guys, this is the best app I have ever used. If you guys like winning money, do it here. Once you sign up, use my promo code MADDYDUBS. They'll give you a free square. What that means is basically Tyrese Halliburton over half a point. Easiest money you'll ever make in your life. Not only that, you can bet on anything you want, any team you want, and they have unlimited things that you can bet on. I mean, look at Kobe White. You have over blocks, lower blocks, lower steals, less turnovers. There's everything, right? Um, but not only that, they will match your first deposit up to $100. Guys, not only are they going to give you free money, but they're going to give you a free square to use as well. And I mean, let's just go down. Let's see how many teams do they have today. They have some Clippers games down here. I mean, Jazz game, they have everything, right? They have MLB, they have golf, they have NHL, tennis, FIFA, soccer, uh, MMA, everything that you can think of they have go check it out get your free money and go try to win some more money with the free square they're going to give you as well go check it out use my promo code in the description let's get back into the video now here's a huge defensive possession here we're going to double team michael porter off that drive bringing in extra defender here with james harden forces michael porter to make a bad decision where he's trying to kick it over to the corner you see a slot cut here by this man i believe that's paid watson doesn't throw it there though, throws it to the corner instead. Norman Powell is able to steal it. Now, this is where things get interesting, man. Now, Russell Westbrook used to be known as one of the most high flyers, one of the biggest highest flyers in the NBA, but still can get up there. And I love the way he's playing with the cast on, whatever it may be, right? Throws it down, gets it to go. You can tell Russell Westbrook wants to win basketball games, man. This is still one of the most hyped players in the nba for a reason he wants to win he loves his teammates and he loves the game of basketball and that is the thing you love the most about russell westbrook is the energy that he brings to his basketball team and is still fully invested now a lot of the clippers offense especially when it's james harden and russell westbrook in the game it's a lot of pick and roll but it's not really the pick and roll that gets you to score it's the action outside of the pick and roll that helps his offense get going so again now we're going to get a high pick and roll what you see here is rotation right everyone is ball watching you got christian brown you got you know all these guys Jokic, all just stepping up and playing the screen right now when we get that you get a thing what's called a slot cut in the nba right so it's basically just a timed cut off the pick and roll right so boom got the pick and roll now we have you know him trying to get over the screen him playing drop zone covered versus you know james harden and then you got christian brown and you know this defender up here over committing to the pick and roll now where you're going to see is russell westbrook slot cutting 
Gonna cut at the perfect time and boom, throws up the lob. You're, you're just not gonna get it. You see a team like the Warriors run this a lot. They run it off the pick and roll uh, with Draymond Green, right? They give the ball to, uh, to Draymond, throws it up to Kuminga. I mean, you see this all the time, but I feel like the um, you know the Clippers do it at such a good level, right? High pick and roll. Let's get the defense to bite down here a little bit. Play that play that zone in the paint, kind of a two nining, which is tapping his feet in and out of the paint. Boom, easy, money, again, beautiful basketball. Now, in my opinion, the Clippers have what it takes to be a championship team. But it comes with toughness, or it starts with toughness, starts with hard work, and it starts with the, the will to want to win a game, right? And um, I think their toughness begins with Russell Westbrook. I mean, you talk about the, the things he's going through right now, not even fully healthy, still playing in these games, and still putting in 100% maximum effort. That is massive. Okay. The Clippers are an underdog. They have a bunch of good players. They have a bunch of guys who fit a system. But they need to play together. They need togetherness. They need, need unity. And if they do that, I think they are the scariest team outside of Denver in the Western Conference. Let me know what you guys think. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Join the family. And I'll see you guys in the next Clippers update. Should be soon. Peace.